Hey y'all, I'm Mandy and this is Mandy in the Making. Today I've got 10 new Amazon finds for your kitchen. I've done one of these videos before and I think I shared nine Amazon kitchen favorites. I will link that video below. So if you wanna go check that out, I'm pretty sure I'm still using all nine of those. They've stood the test of time, I'm still using them. But today I've got 10 new items for you and I've got a couple of bonus items. I actually have 12, <laughs> but two of them, they're bonus and you'll see why. So just stick to the end, but I'm gonna go through these pretty quickly, show you each item in use. And if you have any questions, just leave them down in the comments below. I'll also have everything linked in my Amazon store below. Let's get started. Okay, for our first Amazon find, it is this OXO or OXO. How are you supposed to say that? OXO salad dressing container. Not only does it is it a good container for salad dressing, but you can make your salad dressing very easily in here. I make my ranch in this all of the time. It is leak proof, it will not leak on you. And it has measurements on the side, so you can see exactly how much of each item you're adding in or each product you're adding in, so you don't have to use different measuring cups. You can just throw everything in here, shake it together, and it's ready to go. Sticking with the OXO brand, I got a new sink caddy to hold my sponges and brushes for the sink, and I love it. Previously, I had like a wire mesh one, and it would leak water all over my countertop, and I was constantly having to go in and dry it. I love this one because it has a reservoir at the bottom, and you don't have to take the bottom off to get the water out. It has a little spout, so you can just pour it out, but you can take the bottom off if you want to so that you can clean it but I really do like this one. They have it in stainless steel, but I got it in the white. A newer item that I have purchased for our kitchen is this set of cutting boards. It comes with three and I really love them. You can choose what color you want. They have a lot of different color options. I would say 10 or more, but I love the three different sizes. I also love that it has the little ledge around it so it kind of gathers any juices that may run off, but they are dishwasher safe and super convenient to have. If you're like me, kitchen towels are a difficult thing to find. Either they don't absorb enough or they do absorb, but they leave lint behind. It's this whole thing. It's a lot more difficult than I anticipated. <laughs> I have recently found these new kitchen towels and I am obsessed with them. They wash up really well, they dry really well, they don't leave lint behind and they are super absorbent. Again, they have lots of different colors that you can choose from. These came in a pattern and then in a solid color. And I do love that it also has the little hook so that if you want to hang it up, you can. You get six of these in a pack and they were either $19.99 or $20.99. I will have them linked below. Number five is this pot strainer. I have seen this advertised so many times and I always thought, yeah, that probably doesn't work. But I'm here to tell you, it works. Instead of you having to get a very large colander out to drain your noodles or whatever it is that you're draining, you just clip this on the side of your pot and it clips on very easily. You don't have to touch your hot pot. You're not gonna burn yourself because of the way this is designed. And then you just take it over to the sink and it catches all of the pasta or whatever in the netting part, but it gets rid of all of your water. This is dishwasher safe, which I love. So you can just throw it in the dishwasher and you don't have this large colander to deal with. This again comes in many different colors. I chose gray just because it was a good neutral and it was less than $15. Of course with Amazon, they can change the prices hourly by the minute if they want to, but I know it was less than 15 bucks. In the number six spot are these silicone heat pads. It's a set of four. Again, it comes in lots of different colors but you can use this to set down on your countertop and put a pot on top of it so it doesn't burn the surface. You can also, because they are so thin and you can maneuver them really easily, you can use it as a pot holder and they're very easy to clean since they are silicone. So I love that these are multi-purpose and they don't take up much room in my drawer. They do have a hole, so if you wanted to hang them, that's a good option as well. Okay, at the number seven spot is something very new to me. I just recently got it within the last week but I cannot recommend this enough, especially if you have trouble opening jars. If you're like myself and you have arthritis, this is your new best friend. It comes with the whole set. Again, it comes in different colors, so I just happened to choose this one, but this is a bottle opener. You just open this up, put it around the top of your jar, turn it, and it opens like a dream, no problems whatsoever. 
and it has the small one for like a like a Pepsi bottle or something like that but it also has the ability to open like a glass bottle cap if you have a can that has the pull tab and you struggle with that this portion here will open up the pull tab for you oh and I'm not sure that I mentioned it but the jar opener the two pack is $11.99 at the time I'm posting this okay number eight on my list is a two-tiered lazy Susan and it's for my spice cabinet now hear me out I know these have been around for a while, but every one that I always looked at was too large for my spice cabinet. I am live in an older home and our cabinets are very narrow. I think they're like 10 inches deep. So I really needed a really small two-tiered Lazy Susan. I found this one on Amazon. It's $19.99. It was very easy to assemble. Before, I wish I had a before of our spice cabinet. We had stuff stacked all around each other. Now I had a, another Lazy Susan, just a one flat Lazy Susan in there before. Not all of our spices fit on that. So we had a lot of them stacked over on the side of the spice cabinet and they were falling all over the place. Every time we opened it up, something was falling out. It was about to rack my last nerve. So we got this one. It fits perfectly. I think it's nine and a half inches in diameter. So it fits in there perfectly. It spins. I have a ton of spices on it. It's not too heavy. It spins like a dream and it has really transformed our spice cabinet. The ninth thing I want to share with you today is this air fryer magnet set. I am learning how to cook more things in the air fryer. When I first got my air fryer, I just threw chicken nuggets and french fries in it and that was the extent of my air fryer cooking. But now I'm getting more adventurous and this is a little cheat sheet that you can put on the side of your air fryer if your air fryer is magnetic or on the side of your refrigerator like I have it on mine. It has virtually anything that you can think of that you would like to cook in your air fryer. It has it listed with the temperature and the time that you need to cook it. Super convenient and is inspiring me to cook in my air fryer more. In the 10th spot is this microwave splatter cover and I have to thank my friend Jessie Christine from the YouTube channel, Jessie Christine. She told me about this and it has really been a lifesaver and has kept my microwave so much cleaner. The great thing is it's out of sight, out of mind. It is stored in your microwave. It has magnets on the top of it. So you just pop it to the top of your microwave and close the door. You don't even see it. You never even think about it until you open it up to put some food in to reheat. And then you just grab it from the top of the microwave, pull it down, put it over your food, and it's gonna save so much splatter from going all over the inside of your microwave. It is so awesome. Okay, so that's the 10 things that are definitely kitchen related. I've got two more items that I feel like are great bonuses that I'm really loving. The first item are these little LED night lights. You get a six pack for $9.99. They are wonderful. Obviously you can use them all over your house, but in the kitchen, it makes a great addition. It's just so nice because in the middle of the night, you don't want to turn on all the lights, but if you're wanting to come to the kitchen to get something to drink, you've got just that little bit of light to kind of light your way. And I don't know if I mentioned it or not, but you don't have to turn them on and off. They automatically come on when it gets dark. My last bonus item is just one that I have become obsessed with. It is definitely not a necessity, but it's this dishwasher magnet that says clean or dirty. A lot of the dishwasher magnets that I've seen before, you have to physically move the magnet, like turn it over to say clean or dirty. And I didn't like that. And I wanted something that wasn't so obvious. I love this one because it almost looks like it's part of my dishwasher. Like my dishwasher came that way. And with my dishwasher, it has a clean light on it. So when the dishes are clean, the light is blue, you know, it's clean. But once you open that up, even if you just take out one item and you close it right back, that light goes off. So if you've reached in and you've grabbed one thing and close it back, all that stuff is still clean, but the clean light is no longer on. So we've had instances where people start putting in dirty dishes thinking that everything in there is dirty, but it's not. So this helps a lot. And that's gonna be it for this video. I wanted to make it short and sweet and just share with you some of the items that I've really been loving from Amazon. Let me know below, do you have any of these things that I've talked about? Is there another Amazon kitchen favorite that you have that I didn't share that you think everyone should know about? Leave all of that in the comments below. Just go check those comments, scroll through, see what you can find. And on your way down to the comment section, right underneath this video, give it a thumbs up. That really does help out my channel. And if you haven't already, I would love for you to join my YouTube family. I am always in the kitchen doing food content. And then I do random things like this to share with you these kitchen gadgets every now and then too. Thank y'all so much for being here. I appreciate you more than you know. I will see you soon. Bye.